Okay. Stand out over... Oh yeah, we haven't finished harvesting these guys. Oh, we got cooking level two. Focusing elixir. <gasps> Ooh, focusing elixir might... Does sound like it'd be something that would revert the uh, down brain status effect. The fatigue. Oh. Where'd you get that? I want... Uh, harvesting a bunch of animals gets you cooking. Animals, okay. Uh, I think I still need to figure out how to place something down, though. Okay, so it's probably water magic, then, maybe? That's Rune of Restoration. So, I need to go, I need to go find more fruit, basically, to advance. But, can I place down a foundation out here? Which would be very nice if I could. This is a pretty flat area. Ah! I finally found a flat enough area to place down some foundations. Alright, mortar and pestle. We need... Grass, field flowers, and magic shards. Well, we have some of those. We don't have field flowers. But that'll make focusing elixir can be imbibed to restore some focus after casting spells. Explosive and advanced fire spells used to make glass items. Huh. Maybe these smaller bushes, if I harvest them with a sickle, will give me... Well, they gave me grass, fire blossom. Don't know how to get the little flowers, though. The only ones I've ever been given have been from a quest. Yeah, it's probably the same kind of situation that Ark had where you need to have, you know... Oh, Rune of Restoration unlocked. Nice. Also, what the fuck is this thing? Oh, hello, wolf. This is bad. Just take it on head on. Okay, that thing is really strong. Oh god, there's Draugr. Meteorite. Oh, meteorites with supply drops. Well, that's interesting. Okay, my stamina is so low right now. All right, I'm. S oh, they killed the wolf for me. Good. Now I just have two skeletons I have to kill. Not troublesome at all. I'm just gonna lightly jog around for a little bit. Keep my health up. But hey, we're learning. We're figuring things out. One of those manages to land a hit on me. I'm instantly dead, though. Well, skeletons don't seem to be immune to fire. It's nice. Yeah, they seem to be unfiring really quickly, though. Headshot. Nope. What does it take to kill you guys? Oh, oh, I'm seeing some of parts of him starting to burn. Wait, my craftable fireball broke. Can I craft a new one? I'm missing something. Shit, shit, shit. Okay, good. It's off on the sheet for a second. I need wood. I'm sorry, you don't have enough wood in your inventory to learn how to do fireball. Life drain... 
Does not seem to work very well on undead. Can't imagine why. Ooh, that was close. Also, it seems like I had an armor skill that I picked up somewhere along the way. Wait. Removed craftable iron... S what? I don't know what the hell I just did. Oh, shit. It'd be really good if I didn't have to do this in combat. Ah! Woo! Oh, I wanted his axe. Although I have runes of recall. That's cool. So I can go back to the town. They give me life crystals? Yes, they do. Or magic crystals. Ah! Well, that was fun. Need to go get a drink. And now I need to figure out how to sleep. Unfortunately, I'm not level 15. I'm only level 9, so I can't make the bed. All right, craft a rune of restoration. Cast this to slowly regenerate health. That seems like it might be a useful spell to have on my hotbar. Nice. Ooh, that's actually good spell re or health regen. That's a good 10 seconds of health regen. Okay, I need to craft a campfire, which now requires me 2 wood, 15 stone. Maybe we can start learning some more advanced magic. Yeah, the healing spell, I think, should be a level one thing. I guess it's like kind of like a... Uh, the reason why the fireball broke is it's like a spell tome or like a spell focus. So it's like a crystal that I put in my staff. And it just, you know, that's what broke. Place down the campfire. All right, I'll place one over here since this is kind of my temporary base. I have a lot of fur. Hey, it levels me up to ten. All right, let's get some more health, because that seems to be a useful thing to have an abundance of. And way more focus. I'm about to die from focus, unfortunately. However, I think I might be able to counter that with the healing spell. Nearly broke all my armor there. And what is this? Craftable fireball broken. Oh, so you could just straight up repair. Okay, that's what that is. Well, that's good to know. All right, harvest some straw, harvest some wood. And then straw is... Scythe? Yep, there we are. Craft straw from the campfire. Okay. Okay. Oh, that guard was level 120. I almost had it. Oh, do you actually have the, have the fire going to craft straw? Apparently you do. When guards kill you, do they take your stuff? Slay a beast. Oh, that's easy. Um, Some will loot you, some won't. I think. Get my fairy back. It's kind of still dark. I did slow time down, so at least that setting seems to have worked. Shoot for the flaming sheep! Sheep, I need you to cooperate with me here. I have to finish this quest before I fall asleep. Oh, that was a level 100 sheep. Damn.
Cook meat at a campfire. Alright, sounds like a plan. And once again, the old uh, not being able to go into a campfire bug from Ark, because E is extinguish campfire by default. That's a fun thing. My focus is now zero, so my health is going to slowly drain. Lovely. Death has saved me, yay. I hate how you have to actually manually click what to cook, but I guess that you get more and more recipes as you go. Mm-hmm. Slowly ticking my health away, though. Really wish I could do something else about that. Oh, craft a bedroll! Craft a small storage chest. You can craft a bedroll. Bedroll? Where? I don't know, but Did I need to wait. use one of my magic heals. Ah. Oh. Wait. I don't know if I need to get another skill to learn bedroll. Um, Seems like a survival skill. Bedroll. I need to keep gathering more wood to hit rank three. Survival. So, ghost. I'm assuming this game is translated from Chinese. Because what in the offhand, there's an item called Cobweb of Crystal Ball. Interesting. It says it reduces. Oh god, more the, It says it reduces the weight limit of the enemy that you hit with it. Hmm. That's interesting. Oh, because it could potentially paralyze somebody if it's a PvP. Mm -hmm. If they could come encumbered because you dropped their weight limit. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was the uh, supply drop exploding. Come on, survival. I like how I'm leveling up six different things by hitting this tree right Wait, the now. the supply drop? Yeah, they look like meteors. All right. Can I craft a storage chest first? Yes, I can. Oh, it's casting spells that removes your focus. Mm-hmm. That's... It, it's the, so your health comes back off your stamina bar, and your spell power comes back off of your, uh... other bar. Oh, this earth spell's cool. It, uh... It shows... It gives you a map in front of you, like a holographic, uh, map. Nice, nice. Do you All have right. that yet? No. Um, I'm currently trying to get the bedroll before I die from lack of sleep. Mm. Do I have enough stuff to craft some more of these? Yeah, I'm just going to craft a whole bunch more of these uh, magic heals. So I'm actually keeping myself alive by using spells to offset the fact that I can't, you know, sleep. Which drains my magic faster. Oh, you have to learn alchemy to be able to craft this uh, earth thing. Heal. Alright, I've almost got my survival leveled up. Alright, survival rank 3, which unlocks the bedroll engram. All life energy is from, form, from my natural elements, which can be concentrated into living beings. Discover ways to harvest the essence of fire, earth, and darkness, and you may someday hope to harness the power of these beings. Craft a straw foundation. Done. You had this really, like, long description that sounded really cool, and then craft a straw foundation. Wait, are you able to build? Alright, now I just need to let, reach level 15. Yeah, I found a flat area. It, it, it has clipping issues. You have to find a very flat area. So now I have to reach level 15 to continue this quest line. But, yay! All you have to do is just lay down in a sleeping bag. And I think it might help. That is uh, rather uh, erotic sounding sleeping. Hey, my brain is now full. Sweet. So I'm glad we- Those uh, are not sleeping sounds! I know, right? 
Let's use a heal. There we are. All right. Now we're not on the brink of death. Let's see if we can craft some more food. Just set that to craft all. Throw some more wood on the fire. Ghost, you're level 10. I am. In two levels, you can learn the teleporting spell. Nice. I think it's teleporting. I think it's sent to your town. I've got the like... rune. I've got a couple of runes of recall that I got off oh. of a uh, enemy. That's what they are. Yeah. I didn't realize you could already get those. Yeah. Let's see what other skills I can learn. Decor. Huh. Oh wow! I can craft fancy things, wall torches and stuff like that. I'm I can, find oh, I can actually straight up make a shelter. All right, let me do that. Let's make a little base. I need more wood and twine. Oh, we have wood in here. You okay, goblins are beavers. For some twine. Gobl that's exactly what goblins are. Goblins are beavers. Touch their dams and you will get attacked. What's a goblin dam look like? It's a treasure chest. It's called ah. treasure goblin. I can make leather armor. Oh god, not again. Oh good, they're not going for me. But there is a wraith down here. Oh, now I'm just gonna try to have to find a place to build. Ah, oh, I'm just a little short. I can almost build my entire base. Oh, oh god, it saw me! Oh, this is bad. This is mad. Oh, I found a spot to build. Heck yeah. Oh, it's a floating island! Oh, and firewalls have infinite range. Oh, no. Maybe because race give you ice, they're weak to uh, fireballs? Heal! Why do you have to do this while I'm crafting, you ass? Oh, wait, wait, I think I finished crafting. Oh no, the ceilings. Alright, boars. Boars attack you if you touch them. Come on, one more. Yes! Oh, that crafting ended at just the right amount of time. And now I just have to run for my life and hope my stamina holds out. Woo, that's a combo attack. Come on, sheep. Okay, good. We got a whole herd of sheep up. That looks like another wraith. That's another wraith killing a flock of sheep. Come on, five seconds. Keep on those sheep. I got excited. Heal spell. There's a... Whoa. I found a glow... Oh, he was purple. one hit away. Wait, I found a goblin, but he was purple and a green backpack. Oh, come on! Okay, this guy's only level four, but that guy... Oh, shit. I'm stuck in a corner. Ooh, that just broke all my clothes. I'm now running naked. I want to loot him. He's high level. How do you gather tanks? Oh, God. There goes my stamina. Was he just straw? Oh, boy. Yeah. And we're dead. Damn it. How'd you die? A uh, wraith and a another wraith and a thing. Yeah. All right, I down the, main gate. Wow. I found a goblin. It's like glowing purple. Damn, that's kind of cool. I don't know if that's like... How do I make foundation? Oh well, yeah, the, the uh, hood and cloak yeah. thing that I got is like a hundred armor. Like it's essentially a uh, flak tier for this. Uh... All right, well, we can make a corpse run. Let's actually loot our treasure chest while we're up here and grab our supplies since we're kind of moving away from town a bit. A lot of my oh. ice seems to have melted. I learned leather armor. That 
That's cool. I can make wait, what is do you not have leather armor? Uh, I can make it, but I wasn't able to actually look at making it because that's when the wraith attacked. Oh, it's just like hide and stuff. I thought that sheep was a wolf for a second there. Well, yeah, I need to go make a corpse run to get all my loot back. I'd really like my corpse recovery mod. <laughs> that would be a very nice thing to have right now. I'm in combat again. Oh, hello, Mr. Wraith. Um, you're going to be a bit of a bitch right now, aren't you? Yep, you are. Okay, this isn't leather. This armor looks like it's made of metal. Ow. Aw. That is a mean combo. The Wraith? Or the Banshee or whatever? Well, he has like a chain attack. And that was not great for me. What is the alarm bell? Uh, maybe maybe that's in or out of combat? Ow. Oh god, my fireball spell broke again. I haven't had that happen. Oh, it's getting there. Okay. Keeps doing it in the middle of battle. Okay, I got him stuck on that glitched edge. Um... Repair. Just you wait. Oh shit! God damn it! It got unstuck while I was busy crafting. Nice. There's probably already, like, patches for this game, but I don't want to restart. Because I'm yeah, doing... I'm enjoying what I've got so far going. And other than the double corpse run, it's a little bit annoying. Also, I think Undercity might be a faster spawn place than f front place. Ugh. Oh, we got a level up available. Let's, uh, let's get a little bit more health. Way more focus. The less I have to sleep, the better. Oh man, making a house in this game is harder than art. I thought it was. Oh god, well, the wraith is up here with the sheep now. Alright. Let's have the wraith introduce himself to the town guards. Oh, oh. It was a lot cooler in the Elven Town because a lot of the guards had magic. Oh yeah, all mind you. There's one in the there's at least one in the dwarven area that happened. Alright, ghost, I'm gonna fight Dwarf Cooley. versus Reaper! I'm gonna fight this glowing goblin and see what happens. Ooh. I got a Druidic Staff. A gnarled Druid staff equipped this magic weapon to cast your equipped combat spell. I think I killed, that might be more oh, powerful than the normal staff. I killed the elite gob... Druidic tunic. Ooh. And it had nothing in its inventory. I'm taking Oh, look at body. me. I'm all fancy. I look like uh, the hobbit. Kind of. All right. And I gotta go corpse run to get all my spells back, but... Not too shabby. Looks like we got another storm coming in. How do you see what the effects on your screen are? Um, what are you looking at? There's like this, like, I'm like yawning. There's an icon of yawning. Oh, that means you need to sleep. I also Probably because your mental state is low. Oh, well, I, but my focus is, it's halfway. A little bit of lag when you take all your items off your old inventory, but... I wish I was level 10. Holy shit, the Druidic Staff has a much bigger, like, absorption-looking thing. I wonder if it makes my attacks better. Probably. It, I, I don't see any stats on it. Oh, wait. Damage 2.0. Other one is damage 2.0. Oh, it's the same thing. It just looks different. What am I missing to craft their healing thing? Oh, god, I need a lot of berries to get those. All right. 
hood back on. And what's it take to craft these armors? I need more twine and more fur. Which I think I might have back at the other treasure chest. Alright, so elite goblins literally serve no purpose. At least I didn't have a purpose in that one. Possibly. I still don't know what the alarm is. What, is it like a crafting thing or what? There's there there's a okay. So what's between the water and your brain on your screen? The water in the brain? Oh, my apologies. I will uh, be right back. And now I'm recording again. Thank you for pointing that out. Um, that's um, it's not a bell. Well, it's a bell. It's a dumbbell. Oh, it means I'm almost over encumbered. It's supposed to be like a ten ton weight looking symbol. That's what it mm -hmm. is. I thought it was a bell at first too. I'm like. Oh, I leveled up my offhand by hitting a tree with a shield. Or with a... Oh, either I... Oh, no, I blew up all of my stuff when I was fighting the uh, Reaper earlier. Oh, that's... I was wondering where my bed went. I'm trying to grind levels before I die of uh, focus. Hey, cool thing. Since I'm a dwarf, I don't need to build a second floor to the house because the ceiling's already high enough. Okay. That's fair enough. The perks of being a dwarf. I'm still one ceiling short. I get it, because you're short? Because you're a dwarf? Ha. Huh. You're funny. Straw. Is straw and hay the same thing? I think it is. A few more flying. No see, special, like, that's racist. What? What? It's the same thing. It says hay on the on my crafting requirement, and it gives me experience when I get straw. Also goes. Yeah, 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 I have a house. I am 40 pounds over my carry capacity and still able to walk around. Yeah, you can still walk, which is super nice. It just, I, you can't no, run No, the from joke enemies. you made about him being too short. He said the same thing 10 seconds ago. Well, Ghost is also racist. Okay. Also, I got uh, ranged weapons, Ghost. Do you have ranged weapons? Do you get I do not. Tree? I don't know. Okay. You get, like, throwing knives, and I think the other one's, like, a... something else. A spear. It's a spear. Alright. What do I need to craft a chest? I need more twine. But hey, we're starting to get a little established. I don't know whose, like, farmhouse I'm squatting in right now, but... I also like how fast the uh, trees and stuff respawn in this game. It's very nice for gathering resources without having to go too far. I really like that the controls are very similar to Ark because I don't have to relearn controls. Oh, I need a little bit more wood. That's what I need. Not a fan of all the walls having windows, but... Eh. Yay, I now have a treasure chest so I can dump off half of this weight. Oh, for a second there, I thought my thatch place was on fire, but no, it was just the torch behind it. I have a full house. Ooh. Prepare my fireball, because I'm going to need that back. Keep my gold safe. Don't need the old trousers. Keep that safe. Okay, I've hit that point in encumbrance, but I can't move. How much is it? Uh, I am... 140 pounds up. Damn! That's not too bad. Alright, we now have our fireball spell back. Cool. 
I do like how you can switch in and out of your spells really quickly. So now we need just prove our metal. Maybe there's some other quests we can do. Are you oh. using your second hotbar ghost? I am not. I probably should. It's I use the other one for spells, and then I have a normal one for normal weapons and tools. Creating mortar and pestle sets, creating alchemy knowledge materials. Oh yeah, you should probably make a new mortar and pestle. What does that take? Uh, 65 more rock. So now we've gotten to the point in the tech tree where it's, we're kind of on the grindy side. Rune of Guidance. What the hell is the Rune of Guidance? It says it helps Magical stone imbued with a navigation spell. Correct a magical map on the ground that pinpoints your location on oh, Arcos. That That's kind of cool. It I, it's like, you need to do alchemy stuff to get it. Though. Yeah, it takes way too much to earn it, but... I keep my eyes peeled because this is where the goblins attacked me last time in this forest. Goblins actually only die, like, they die like three to four fireballs. At least the elite one did. I can make a new bed roll, so I should probably go place one of those down. I oh. like how sleeping is actually a thing in this, rather than there's just beds for respawning in kind of a thing. I hope you can still respawn in them, though. Um, I have yet to figure that out, because it didn't let me have the option last time, but I could also blew it up with a fireball before I could, uh, do anything, so. Crafting ceilings isn't as good for uh, experience as it is in art. You're trying to grind with crafting? Kind of. I'm, I'm a level, like, I'm half a level away from getting a bedroll. Okay, this whole, like, one seal, one wall high house thing doesn't work as well for elves. Oh, cool. You can straight up just turn stones into, uh, the powder. So I might actually try this, uh, magical crystal thing. Let's see if, like, what the map looks like. Heck yeah, full house. It's really short, but it works. Crystals doesn't work so well out of rocks. I think the trees work a lot better as a magic crystal source. I mean, life magic would, you know, from living things seems like a smarter way to do it. All right. Do we have enough to craft the magic map? Yes, we do. One magic map spell coming up. What is this? Resurrection Altar, a powerful altar for resurrecting the dead. Construct this to add a respawn location on death and teleport between altars. Um, okay. Uh, that we best need be cheap. 75 stone powder. 75 oh. of the other powder, and then 100 magic crystals. And bones and stuff. What is the necromancy? necromancy? Yep, Crit's got his necromancy. What do these things need? Raw sulfur. Oh, cool. Goes. what does that rune look like, the map? Um, it looks like a map. Oh. Alchemy, rank two. Glass bottle unlocked. Oh, that is fucking cool. Hmm. That is cool. It's a 3D map. You can walk through it. It's an illusion. Oh. Yeah, the whole, okay. That, that is amazing. That is a fucking cool spell. And when you, as you turn, it changes the arrow so you can point yourself in the direction you want to go. So like oh, that way is a volcano. It shows where you are and everything. Yeah. It's a, actually, it's a location spell. It's a really good spell. That's cool. Can I 
harvest this big rock? Or is this a decoration? That's a decoration rock. Uh, there's more rocks over here by the river. But yeah, that is... That's an awesome map. I like that a lot. Do I have 75 rock yet? Almost. Oh yeah, I'm glad there's necromancy in there for you, crit. Actually, that should be enough sulfur because I already had a bunch of sulfur. I mean, let's not let's be honest here. It's necromancy in the effect that you can respawn there. I don't think you can resurrect the actual dead. Uh, I saw something where you can. I think it was in the taming crafting tree. The item description was like use the soul the souls of creatures you have slain to summon familiars. All right, let's now not I need to get a hundred magic. Familiars. It's I mean. It's Unless I can kill a dwarf and resurrect a dwarf, it's not necromancy. All right, true. But it's life and death magic, <laughs> no, no, at no. least. Look, look, look. Necromancy. Oh, hello, uh, welcome. We got the devs the in words. the chat. Uh, we have devs in chat? Hey, My devs apologies in, for not noticing you instantly. I was busy devs crafting in things. in chat, is there necromancy? And if so, if not, can we get necromancy? <laughs> like ASAP. Dark and my official. I like this. Yeah, I... Okay, I didn't realize that was an actual death. Necromancy. That's my feedback. Necromancy. <laughs> Where's Foxy? She had a lot of stuff to say about the game just from watching Ghost play. She's currently not around. Honestly, the big things are beds craftable at level 1, because running around with the Dwarven Innkeeper clipped through the ground is, you know, and not being able to sleep or, would be bad. Or... Or and they he'll spell can earlier. focus on necromancy. All right, so Ghost, I'm just gonna point this out. He said bring a dwarf back to life, and you're playing as a dwarf. I'm pretty sure he wants you as like his like little servant thing. Look, I might want to make an army of de undead ghosts. Yes. Oh, ghost. <laughs> I mean, I I'm assuming since you can knock out and tame goblins and things like that. Like, I mean. You know, resurrecting yeah. people and having them, you know, look like the Draugr or they something. They like necromancy. They like necromancy. Yeah. We agree. Ooh. Necromancy's well, fun. Well, there you go, Crit. You've influenced the devs. Cool. Okay. Ghost, eat some flowers. They tell you to eat flowers. I have not actually found any flowers. I don't know how to get them. What? This fl I want flowers. The only flowers I've ever gotten are the ones given as the quest reward. Hey, wait. Oh, wait. Maybe if I just pick these things that look like flowers... Using my bare hands, I will yeah, get flowers. Yeah, might might help. Might give you flowers. Didn't give me flowers. Where are the flowers? Cut the bush wow. with a sword and you get flowers. Bush, sword. Oh, oh my sweet. god, that is amazing. Okay. I also got those from an end. Hold on a second. Now eat them. We gotta kill a spider real quick. It didn't do anything. Oh. No, no, no. You gotta lick a spider. You lick the spider, go. I'll lick the dead spider. The live one is probably gonna be a little dangerous. I mean... Wait. If you're a wimp, I ate the flower. Yeah, how was it? It didn't Don't do it. Don't for go. Hey, I killed it. Level 72. Oh! Oh! Nothing good oh. in it, damn. The flowers are good. The flowers are good. Crystals, please. Eat, eat the flower. Actually, ghost. what? Is there any unique materials I can get from these guys? Raw meat. Does not look like the spiders give anything unique. Oh no! Oh wait, those are flowers from the ground underneath. Eat oh, that's how you flowers. get berries really well too. Eat the flowers. It's nothing bad, by the way. I, I don't care. The devs say eat flowers. You yeah, eat flowers. it gives you your mana back. No, it gives you your focus back. Oh! See, the way the tutorial explained it, it sounded like mana, not focus. I need ten more magic energy, and I can make a uh, respawn point. Hey, I can craft range stuff, too. Throwing knives? Oh, man, now we're getting all the cool stuff. What the hell?
hell is that? Oh, it's just a water plant. Okay. Mortar and pestle should be done. We'll take this, we'll take this, and we now should have enough stuff to craft a resurrection stone. I can't wait to get our server working on this, though. Oh, yeah. This I is going to be fun with more than one person. If the devs can... happen to have a, you know, official how to make your own server with the launch thing so it actually appears for people, because I can, I've got the server where it says it'll run, but I can't find the server when I try looking, even when I add the IP list. Oh, wow, I just unlocked all of the uh, gear stuff. All right, one reviving altar. Oh, cool, and it's the fast travel point, too. Now, cool. can you sacrifice someone to that? I mean, you could probably kill somebody on it. All right, Ghost, go get a sheep, drag it to the altar, kill it on the altar. Look, it even looks a little bit like a blood basin, Ghost. <laughs> you know what they were thinking when they made that. I don't know if I can get a sheep over here, though, but I'll try. You might have to tame a sheep. I don't know how to tame. I wish I knew how to tame. Maybe she'd be grass. Maybe she'd be grass. Yeah, that would be another thing I need to figure out how to do. Also, what does throwing knives take? Uh, rock. I want to. I want to make some throwing knives on my way. Uh, where's an actual environmental rock? There we are. Oh my God, the dodge. Okay. Throwing knives. Ghost, have you used this dodge roll yet? I've done it, but never on purpose. You double tap, like, the side button. Oh, there we go. Nice. Can I dodge roll forward? Dodge roll up? You can jump back? Okay, that is really cool. I need a drink of water. So whenever you're fighting a wraith, you can just d jump back and throw your knives out. Yeah, you basically want to make it so that the uh, foundations don't require a perfectly flat area. Yeah. Like... And, and this might come off a little weird, but uh, a mod for Ark, S Plus, did a really good job of it where it made a foundation that was just X size and could be placed, but always was at a level. Yeah. And also it extended down to meet the ground. That way you, what you can do is you can have the top of it not clip, but just have it extend down so it sits on the lower part. Like if I put it on this side hill, let me actually just craft a foundation so I can show the devs. Oh, wow, the throwing knives are fairly heavy. But, uh, yeah, like, this cannot be crafted because it clips in on the top part. But if it just accepted the top part and then extended down on the left-hand side so it touched the ground and allowed you to build the foundation, it'd be nice. Because that was the first patch of land that I wasn't in a town that I was actually flat enough to build a foundation, which is why I'm based over there. <laughs> All right, we have a sheep. I'm going to get its attention with the throwing knife. And now I'm going to chase it all the way to the altar and finish it near the altar. Oh, having some issues with the terrain steepness. Um, how do you throw a throwing knife? Aha! Run, sheep! Run! Yes! Towards the sacrificial altar. So you hold down right-click for throwing weapons, and then you release. Alright, so it's, it's like uh, Friday the 13th, but with right-click instead of Mill Mouse. Because some games do it, you have to prime it, then throw it. Other games do it, prime it and release. Yeah. Alright, come on. Returning, sheep. We're turning. Good, good. Down the road. I like how it has the two knives still stuck in it. All right, the sheep is not intelligent enough to... There we go. It's having some issues, but we'll get it there eventually. Nope, Good. stop turning all the way. Hurting with throwing knives. It's Everyone's also favorite. level four, so it's uh, going to actually Good. be able to be sacrificed on your sacrificial altar. Good. So, like... I didn't realize, though, that the sword being a actual... Tool and gathering weapon. tool. Yeah, that's a. It's nice to know that. Just swing it, just randomly and get put. No, I have to actually do it on bushes. I need more blueberry so I can craft another heal spell, basically. Well, at least I get the field flowers. That's really nice. Okay, we're getting close, crit. 
All right, so Ghost, you have to you have to chit Kali Ma the entire time. Got it? All right. Let's get it turned around the corner. Kali Ma, Kali Ma. Oh, damn it. Um, is this close enough, spe or crit? Because it's stuck against the wall now. Is it within like a ten meter radius? Yes. Go for it. Kali Ma, oh. Kali Ma. Wait, wait. Ooh, I can fill a water jar from the sheep. No. Dude, ah, drag body. fill it with its blood! Drag body. And... There. Wait. Good. Now, resurrect me a sheep minion. Do it! Kalima. Kalima. Here, I'll bring a fairy around. Come on, fairy, heal. Bring my sheep back to life. You, you do the thing from Legend of Zelda. Heal him. <laughs> heal the sheep. <laughs> oh, I... that was fun. Ghost, I thought I had a tame. Oh, wow. Dwarves can jump. Bet you forgot how to tame. Yeah, oh, fair. what'd you do? Uh, well, I didn't tame anything yet, but if you go into your skills and you go to range crafting and you look at like the rank two stuff, which is ah okay, low, and um, if you hover over the stone hook arrow, this is it can be used. Stone to tipped arrow to fell weaker prey. Stone hook arrow, ropes tipped with stone. Fire these from a bow or crossbow. Trap and tame small animals. Okay, so I need to gather more stones or craft range weapons. I think I have range powder? weapons. How do I get gunpowder? Uh, crafting, uh, uh this is thing. Probably sulfur rock. Alchemy? Yeah. But there's not a recipe for gunpowder. Uh, do you though. have a mortar and pestle? I... It's sulfur powder, basically. Okay. Uh, are you sure it's sulfur powder? Because sulfur powder is orange. Like, like reddish. The other one is black. It's probably a higher tier one. Let me check under uh -huh. alchemy. Uh, yeah, it is Dark Zone Stand? No, that's level five. Um, ground bone. Maybe there's explosives somewhere. Maybe it's under fire magic. Ooh, I'm three levels away from being able to learn my next tier of magics. How do I craft? Thalmaturgy, enchanting. That's ink. Okay, I'm just going to craft a whole bunch more uh, ranged weapons then. Just spam craft them to get my leveling skill up. Uh, what do we need? We need more wood, stone, and fiber. I wonder if the spears are faster experience. That needs just more stone and fiber. But yeah, no, this is, uh, once you start getting the hang of the game and whatnot, definitely if that, fun. If that gunpowder stuff isn't in, like, a, the alchemy tab, I'm assuming it's a harvestable resource. Or it might be something you can only buy from shops, maybe? maybe. I can see they're putting a focus on the shops, especially if they're, you know, they have these towns, they want you to go to them. Yeah, that'd be really cool having focus on the, that's a wolf. Or hyena looking thing. At the same time, though, if they're going to be a. You, you can't craft them, there does need to be, like, a way to get them without spending gold. Yeah. Because, like, what happens if you need gunpowder, but you're out of gold? Great, I think you can steal from barrels, can't you? That's how you got apples and gold, isn't it? Yeah, that's how I got the gold originally. Okay. So that could be it. Uh, let me craft a few more of these spells. Alright, we've got a spear. Ranged weapons. Okay, the spear did a decent amount for ranged experience. It's about 12%. Let's see, are you low enough level that I can actually take you down? No, you are 72. I'm gonna leave you alone. Uh, ghost that says he's a thief, get him. <laughs> I'm really surprised the guards in town didn't get mad when I started breaking barrels for stuff. It's a quest. I know, but still. Halt right there, criminal scum. I didn't steal any sweet rolls, I promise. Meat takes a long time to cook, but, like, the one thing I like is that cooking or, like, crafting structures can craft more than one item at a time. Yeah. Oh, really? That's nice. Because that's, like, one of the biggest slowdowns Oop, in the I arc. ranked up offhand, offhand. I can make a shield. And a cobweb of crystal ball. That was what you were talking about before, right? 
Ooh, that is 30. Reduces their weight limit, so it makes them slower. Yep. Also, these pants require a little bit more fur and a little bit of hide. I think I actually have that in my chest. I need... I actually can make the tree bark if I can get one more hide, which... Let me go open my chest and see if I've got that in there. I like my little fairy companion, though. Uh, no. I do not have hide. At least I have some money, though. Um. Oh, wow. Some of these uh, items I have in my inventory are fairly heavy. Let's put these back in here for right now. Did you not spice your meat, Ghost? Uh, I... The berries, I can't figure out how to get more of them consistently. I, I get them every once in a while when I hit bushes and stuff, but... Uh, blueberries? Yeah. I have 5,000. Yeah, Holy but you're, you're over in the uh, Elven Forest, which had a bunch of them when I was over there. I, I oh, maybe think... maybe Dwarf is the hard mode. Because I, I punched this bush, I got 30. I just keep... I think you... Because like, you've noticed, like, there's a lot less, like, apples and stuff. And 500 more right there. Alright, how many more of these things can I craft? Uh, have you seen, like, the big red flower type bushes go? Uh, no. I don't think they're in this biome area. Hmm. Yep, glad, glad you stopped by the stream and, uh... Remember necromancy <laughs> next update please <laughs> i don't care if it's the worst thing on the planet as long as i can kill ghost and resurrect him more than one time <laughs> oh that's great please from what i'm seeing i would like to see like something that locks you into like a magic or a tech base or a warrior like system not being able to go through all three I, I like the ability to do all of them because, yeah, you know, it's what if you're based on what you, you do. So if you don't yeah. do any warrior stuff, you can be a, essentially a mage. But it doesn't lock you away, so you don't need a new character for the other See, because, Duke, you played Skyrim recently, so you're still kind of in the Skyrim idea where there's a, you know, there is a limit on what you can do. Ah, there he is. Well, I just like the challenge that gives, but... Oh, oh, got some lag. Oh, we're good. I like the devs are responding to, like, all the community feedback. Oh yeah, that's so good when devs actually, you know, go to release day streams. And I gotta that's say, you like, see. that's where you see if your game is good or not, if people are streaming it, and if the streams are on fire. Yeah, I wasn't expecting much from early access, but this is actually fairly, you know, well compiled. Yeah, you know, we were joking, like before Ghost actually started playing, we were joking like, oh, it's just it's just Arc Light, but no, this is definitely its own exper experience. Ooh, okay, so apparently you can't hold down too long on your aim, otherwise your aim gets shaky. That's kind of cool. Okay, throwing spears. Not doing a lot of damage to this hyena. It must be pretty high level. Yeah, Knife to the face. Place. Knife to the face. Knife to the face. A bargash. I need to start... Ooh, ooh, you get your, your stuff back. Or some of them back. Nice. Need more life crystals. Magic shards. Yeah, spice beat. Let's eat a little bit while we're sitting here. So is that a what is a bargash? Basically, a hyena. Okay, it's it like could a tell war if it was supposed to be a hyena a or a very small horse. No, it's this like a like... war dealy. Ooh, this, this guy actually has hide. I need to actually harvest more specifically hide. I'm a big fan of the light fairies. Like the light spell is really like my most used. Okay, this requires. Ooh, I need copper ore to do that. Um, I need more wood, and I can make the wooden shield. Player leveling's a little bit on the slow side. Ghost, did you make You're playing, direction? like, pretty base raids. You're used to, like... This, this yeah. Because like, we gotta remember, Ghost, with, with Ark, you're, like, you know, you're used to, like, what is it? We play with 20 something. experience? 20, yeah. Yeah. You're playing the game how it's, you know, at closer to how it's intended to be played. It, it feels very RPG, like, MMOs, like, rates. Like, I'm gaining levels, but not, like, crazy quickly. So you get to experience all of the things that level gives you. 
I can make Whereas Ark, we're just like, we've played this a million times, give us our levels, let us craft a fabricator. What was I supposed to be crafting again? Saving. I was getting more wood to craft something. Ah, shield. Oh, my apologies. I've yeah, I've left the level ups uh, kind of alone. Let me get some more stamina, and let's go with more mana so I can use magic more. Now that we're getting stronger and stronger, we now have a shield on our offhand. I do apologize about that. I was. It's actually a very non obnoxious you have a level up, which is nice. Ghost, even the one in Ark you ignored for like the entire like hour at a time when you first started playing. Ooh, Thundergrass. Ooh, I'm getting blueberries Wait. from these bushes in the water. It's Thunder. Is Thunder a spell? Ooh, farming. Tier 1 farming. I can make a crop plot. Nice! Wow. Oh, heck yeah. Can you Farming grow apples. necromancy stuff? No, you need, you need blueberries. Oh yeah, you can actually you can actually grow elemental Bones. seeds. So there's probably a dark elemental seed. Awesome. So I'm just gonna be nothing but dark element when I when I play. I, I do like the fact you can kind of focus down the different elemental paths. I am I am going to be death destroyer of worlds. All right. Can I make a crop plot? Oop, nope, I need eight more. All right. And one crop plot. Let's see, that is berry jam. Some Dude, berries to jam. make berry jam. Eat it to recover food and water. Oh, that's 45 berries. Holy shit. All right, let's put our crop plot outside and see what it does. I have so many throwing knives, it's not even funny right now. Oh, I learned frost bolt? When did I learn? How do I get ice cube? Uh, from oh, it needs to be fertilized, apparently. Um... Ghost, you know what you have to do. Die on it. Ghost, die on it. Fertilize it with your corpse. So it doesn't look like I can grow blueberries. Seedlings can be planted to grow shrubbery. Tough but root containing earth energy. Plant in a large field to produce calendulas. Produce thundergrass. Produce cherry bomb blossoms. Yep, done. Now remember, Ghost, you need to fertilize it with your corpse. Not irrigated. Not fertilized, not seeded. Okay, so we know that system. Alright, can we make a water jar? We craft one thing of paper, just in case that's a requirement for something. A water jar requires eight, four, and six. I think I have actually all of those. Wait, what's berry jam? Is it jam? Recover on some bread. I want ice cubes, ghost. Where do you find rape? Oh wait, hard mode. That's what you find. Yeah, I think I think dwarfs honestly might be hard mode. Uh, no, there was a. I did I see race when I was doing the other thing? No, I saw ants and stuff. So it might be a regional thing. Well, just the fact that you you're a little bit scarce around resources too. Well, All right, there. filled up my water bottle. Have you made a shield yet, Ghost? Uh, yeah. Pretty useful. Well, I failed. Sword and shield. And it actually works just like you'd think a sword and shield would. So I was trying to figure out how to talk to someone. I accidentally hit them with my axe, and next thing I know, I got fireballed. Oh, yeah, that's official. great way. No, no, no. Axes, definitely, like, the hello of all cultures. All right. It and is. not, you know, hello. You're playing on official, dude? Now, what fertilizes? Thatching and weaving. <laughs> Rotten meat. Eating this would make you sick. Uh, yeah. what, what, what would make sense fertilizer-wise? Uh, feces. There's a death key. Or use your corpse. 
What's to the defecate? Fertilize. Key? I'm not sure by default I changed it. Alright. Options. Key bindings. Unassigned. Um it'll be number pad zero. Defecate, please. Oh, maybe the number pad doesn't work. Or maybe um, you need to have numlock on to use the number pad. Make it. That's all stay put. Um, key? Key for poop. Hopefully that's not an important button. Uh, I'm not able to defecate. Have you been alive for too long? You forgot how to poop? Well, I like the split button. How do I... Transfer. Nope. Huh. I don't know how to plant a seed yet. Maybe if I read up on the actual skill of farming, it'll tell Probably. me. Probably. Oh, I can craft ice. Oh, you can? How do you do it? Oh, you can uh, craft fertilizer oh. at higher levels. With a glass bottle? Oh, compost oh, bin. Yeah, with a glass bottle in magic. But a glass bottle needs this gunpowder and stuff that I don't know how to get. I need... 50 more wood. I think I had... No, I don't have a stack of wood in here. Damn. Because I want to see what cherry bombs do. 